Panic and fear porn. Are you a victim of panic and fear porn right now? A few hours ago, Donald Trump, our president here in the United States, declared a national emergency because of coronavirus. I'm curious what you think of that. I know that what I think is I think it was necessary. The public does want a response from our president and to, to let's just say, to satisfy or calm the masses, that's what's needed. Or should I say calm the sheep? The coronavirus, do you look at it as fear porn? Do you... I do believe there is an issue, but do you look at it as, was it an economic bioweapon? Do you think the necessary school closings and public gathering closings, whether it be the golf tournament, the NBA, hockey, has all been canceled or postponed? Are you panicking right now? Are you the leader of your family? Whether you're a man or a woman, are you, you know, pushing panic on your kids or your daughters or sons or other people in your family, possibly even your mom and dad? I hope not. So don't panic. What's the worst that could happen? You'd have to stay home from work and spend time with your kids or spend, spend some time with your family, which I don't think is a bad thing. It sounds like to me that everybody's gonna have enough toilet paper, that's for sure. I'm not sure why there's a shortage of toilet paper. I think that's kind of funny. There's no shortage of paper towels. I think that would do the trick too. But anyways, don't be a victim of fear porn. I mean, that fear porn, fear porn has basically, you know, put some damage to the stock market. And if you look back and look at the dates of whether it be the swine flu, everything is in, the, in an election year. Now, why is that? Is there some sort of narrative? And if you look back on my video, about the coronavirus, you'll find some interesting points that I made in a video I made about a month or so ago called Question Everything. Now is the time when you question everything. Who do you believe and what do you believe? What outlets do you go to to get your fear porn information? Well, take your information and use your brain, question everything that's said, and I think it will ease your mind. Fear porn and panic is real. Again, let's look at the dates on starting back with, I think it's AVID and swine flu, SARS, but everything is in in election year. Is that coincidence? I don't know. If you'll notice too that the wonderful left really isn't saying much now. They want to put all the blame on Donald Trump. Again, I do question Donald Trump, but all the blame has to be pointed somewhere. So tell me what you think. Are you panicking? Uh, are, you, are you supplied? Are you ready? Do you have some cash reserves? Because that's pretty important. Are you able to not to go to work for two weeks or a month if that is going to be the issue for you? Worst case scenario for me, I won't go to the job. Instead, I'll go over to the beach 
swim in the ocean. I don't have an issue with food. I can protect myself. I can protect my family. If that's the worst case scenario, it won't be that bad. So protect yourself. If you have to take a little vacation, hey, so be it. But don't panic. Don't buy into the fear porn. Shut off the TV. Stay safe. Stay happy. Stay positive. One final quick question. Does anybody out there, anyone, know a person who has COVID-19 coronavirus? Do you actually physically know someone who has been tested positive for the virus? I would like to know. Don't panic, relax. I'm Tony Bruno. You can find me on Twitter at T21Surfer, on Instagram on T21Surfer, I'd like you to share this video with everyone you know. No panic. Talk to you soon.